Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to a, another Route 24 video. This is Destiny Connect on the PS4. If you missed the last part, of course you will find a super handy link down in the description. Go ahead, check it out. Uh, skim through it, or we'll watch the whole thing, whatever works for you. So we're back in the year 2030, right they said? Yeah, that's what I think. Yeah. Um, to try to figure out what's going on, and now we, we got Altana in the party, and he just like, I'll tell you the whole truth, just come with me, and then now we're back. Uh, in the future, I guess. So what do you think he's gonna say? Like, what's your guesses so far? So who is Altana? What's his deal? Uh... So I think he's Sherry's kid in the future. Sherry's kid in the future? Yeah, maybe. So who's the dad, though? I don't know. You think it's just like a random... It could be a random person, or maybe like she got together with Peglio. She was like, wow, you actually are pretty powerful there. With your bomb shit from your backpack. With your bomb shit? Yeah. Like, that's gonna be the actual quote of, that'll be in the game? Well, pretty sure they're not gonna say shit in this game. Right, it'll be... I just kind of, It'll you know, be bomb, like, doo-doo. Yeah, They exactly. do say kuso in Japanese, though. True, but I feel like that word is, like, fine. You know, to be used by kids and stuff. Like, in Japanese. Mm-hmm. Like, it's not treated as badly as the word shit is like back in western countries right so i was looking for this one the whole time it was just at the bottom of the list we'll get like five sure just in case we keep dying we have new items as well um Looks i don't know like if it's worth it. it we do have actually a lot of money i think we can go ahead and we'll upgrade um so we have four humans in the party now which one? If wow. we don't have enough money, you can always sell a bunch of yeah, stuff. Yeah, we'll have to, to sell. Um, we're broke. Yay. We're not broke. We have 8,000 G. Yeah, G. Okay, well, let's go and actually just sell all our old stuff. This is the first time we've sold anything in the game. Yeah. And I'll really quickly go in, equip that. Oh, to sell the other stuff. Wow, negative 27. We yeah. only got uh, a hat and shirt, right? We didn't get shoes yet? Yeah, right. we didn't get shoes yet. I really wish there was a, like an optimizer button. Yeah. Or like you could just equip it when you're buying it. That would be handy. Yeah. Are we rich again? Kinda, sure. Wow, there's a lot of stuff. Whoopsie daisy. Depends on how much this G is worth. Because if it's like dollars, then we're fucking doing pretty well. It's probably the equivalent of yen. Well, then we're not doing that well. I remember when I was like, you know how in the English versions of Pokemon, they use like Poke Dollars, right? It's mm -hmm. like the yen side, but with like a P. Right. So all the English versions of Pokemon use Poke Dollars. And then in Japan, in the Japanese version, it's just, it's just yen, right? Mm -hmm. So growing up as a kid, I was always like, wow, like I got like 500 polka dollars from <laughs> winning this fight. I'm rich. Yeah, I'm rich. Wow. And then like you switch over and you play the Japanese game and it's like 500 yen, which is just like $5. Yep. Uh, totally different. Um, it just really changes like the perspective of like, how rich you are in, yeah, exactly. in, in that game. Uh, hat and shirt, right? So now we need shoes. Uh, but yeah, so... That was, I wouldn't say like culture shock in a way, but it was it was it was a weird change, like s switching over to the uh, to the Japanese versions of Pokemon when I started playing them in Japanese. Mm -hmm. It does make sense though. Yeah. For it to be yen. And then you know people are just like, oh, of course, like you you would beat a kid in a Pokemon battle, and then you know he gives you five hundred yen. That's way more reasonable for a kid to have five hundred yen. Right. Than a kid having five hundred Poké dollars, I guess. Well, how do we know how much a polka dollar is worth? Yeah, I guess the yeah, I guess it could be pretty weak. Um, low, low value currency. 
I think that's why they called it like polka dollars instead of just dollars. Dollars, yeah. yeah. Well, there's more than one like currency. Like there's more than one dollar in in the world. Um. That's true, but I mean, I guess people would just associate it with whatever their own. Whatever dollar currency they have, is. yeah. Or if they if they're in a country that that uses the dollars. All right. Um, I think we actually got another gear for Isaac, right? So let's go ahead and slot that right in. This was his gladiator gear. Oh, right. So I'm let's... excited to see this. Oh my god, what? So he's a boxer now, a champion form. That's not what I was expecting. But okay. What do you think he, uh... Oops. What do you think his skills are gonna be? Hmm. I don't know. Wow, I can only make one silver gear, um, but you can make like a, a bunch of bronze gears, yeah. Bronze ones. Where's this champion form? All right, let's go ahead and slot these in. Oh, but we've got a bunch of yeah. Silver we actually ones do already. have a lot of silver gears. Well, Maybe that's why you like didn't <laughs> have enough materials to make very many. Because I just made so many. Already. Yeah. Cool. All right, we spent a lot of time in the menus here, so let's go ahead and just uh, learn the I guess, truth. Yeah. Oops. So this future looks a little bit more like the remains of a town the oh yeah it, for town. sure like when we were here before it was just like a wasteland right mm -hmm. with like you could just see the clock i should play in the i should use the bigger map more often you see more of the yeah i was thinking that as well well it's especially useful for right now with just like all the little paths yeah that like you can take. it's like it's like if it's just like a big field it doesn't it doesn't matter all that much but yeah mm -hmm. I wish you could rotate, like, party members out in the middle of a fight. Oh yeah, me too. That'd be cool. I mean, we do have Isaac and he can change forms, which is kind of, kind of, like, similar. You can get him to do different things. Yeah, it's almost like you're changing characters or something. Gonna check out the new form. Right. Ha! Huh, that's cute. Um... All right, so this is evasion up, it looks like. And... Oh, this will guarantee a critical hit on your next attack, it looks like. That's cool. That's pretty good, yeah. And then... Oh, this slow down enemies. Oh, cool, let's try that. Did quite a bit of damage as well. That's true. So did that. Oh, but apparently not that much. How much HP does Isaac have? Oh, it's a miss anyways. Mm. Um, we can try to get this guy to like delay his turn. We can knock him out of the, the turn order. Or it can kill or him. He'll just or it'll die. kill him, yeah. That's totally fine. <laughs> Nice, getting a bunch of criticals in. I actually kind of like, like, everyone. Yeah. Excalibur. <laughs> oh god. He's almost dead, but it's fine. We'll finish this fight. Or we can actually get him to change, and uh, we'll get him to just heal himself. Yeah, that's a good idea, because that robot, that mecha gets to go next. Uh, no, it was this one, yeah? Yeah. Heal me. The fact that Isaac can change form, like, he has, like, we have, like, two to three more forms left to unlock, right? Uh-huh. Um, so he's just really, just himself is really versatile. Right. So if Sherry and any, like, or, or two other party members, if they just died, we could maybe get the fight to just... You know, we could just have Isaac just kind of do the thing. 
Probably, yeah. Do the thing. He could probably survive on Anything his own. Anything over here? No? That's kind of disappointing. I was expecting, like... Well, I mean, those other places have, like, actual treasure markers on them. So. Where I was expecting, like, a... What are those called? Like, the crystals? Why are crystals? you going back? To heal. Oh. I was expecting, like, a... The... 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 I guess it's possible. Maybe at the we end We just haven't of that seen other... one in a long time. True. I just feel like I'm just missing them. You know what I mean? Like it's possible. I mean, check this one. See if it's there's a if thing down there's here. There's anything here? Yeah. That sign confused me at first. Nope. Just a sad little dead end. This game is doing it on purpose. I bet you, like, if a game designer was watching me play, he'd be like, "Why are you going over there? There's nothing there." <laughs> There's like, you know, there's the two types of people who like when they people who like when they play RPGs or any game, they like have to check every single yeah, corner or whatever. It depends on my mood for me. Cuz like sometimes I just get tired of checking every single spot. I get like burnt out yeah. from doing it. So mm -hmm. I just like I'm going to go through this as quick as I can. That's why I like like to talk about like um I guess FF13 like everyone gave the game a hard time for just being so linear. It was like, they call, people called it like hallway simulator or whatever, mm -hmm. right? I didn't mind it that much. That's just because like, as a player, it really made the game like simple to play, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like... Like sometimes it's good just to like have a story and, you know, not have to like get burnt out checking all the different little areas. Yeah, not, exactly. Like I just kind of ran down the hall and, and then I didn't have to worry about Oh, am I missing something? Or, or, or whatever, right? Mm -hmm. Sherry might die. Oh, she's up next, so we're all good. Oh yeah, so I was talking about like in the last part or whatever, but like, mm -hmm. can we speed up parts oh, of the right. battle? I just took and a look at the options. No. Yeah, I took a look at the options after, and there's an option that makes the battles like um, anytime it's not your turn, anytime that you're not in a menu, uh -huh. it will just like fast forward the fight. Oh, which is really good for saving time, but really bad for I don't know immersion, mm -hmm. mood or something. Oh, cool. Cool. That'll come in handy, maybe. What am I running into? Sorry. <laughs> a rock. I got stuck on something, and then there was a bush in front of the camera, and I just yeah. really couldn't... Couldn't see. I didn't know what I was going into. Are you going to go into that little cranny over yeah, there? Yeah, why not? Well, I want to get that treasure <laughs> chest, so we're going to do a little loop around here. Just another little stop sign. Have we seen that dog thing before? I don't think so. It just looks like a hair dryer. Yeah, kind of. It's cute. Uh oh wow, the thing is like super weak to ice. That's crazy. Well, I know what we're gonna use. Let's just take care of it now then I guess. Nice. That's just like that wasn't even a critical, that was It was just weak to it. Yeah. Yeah, with those two, if you have, like, enemies yeah, any... that are weak to elementals, you're good. Yeah, exactly. Or Isaac, apparently. Isaac is just a generally a good character. Mm -hmm. He's, like, multiple characters in one. He's, like, you can ch change, like, job class, essentially. He can do fucking anything. He's a time machine. You know? Yeah. For sure. This is the first, like, Nipponichi game that I've played that I've, like, enjoyed, I think. Really? Yeah, I mean, I know they make... Like, Nipponichi makes a lot of games. They put games out, um, like, at least once a year in Japan. Mm -hmm. uh, and they're good. Don't get me wrong, they're good. They're interesting, um, but I just, I just really... Couldn't get into them? Yeah, I just kind of didn't really get into them. But this one looked a little different, and it's easy to get into. It's, like... This is just genuinely like a, a pretty 
you know, good game to get into. Mm -hmm. So I think it's the first Nipponichi game that I've yeah. really liked. I don't know if I've really gotten into a Nipponichi game. I feel like mm -hmm. I can't think of anything off the top of my head. So maybe I haven't. Yeah, I mean, I, I usually, like, I play lots of Square Enix stuff. Mm -hmm. A lot of, um, I don't know, I, I don't want to say a lot of Sega, but I would say just Square Enix and Nihon Takum sometimes, like Ease, mm -hmm. Legend of Heroes, uh, those are really good games. I recommend them if you haven't checked them out yet. Oh no, I don't have enough SP for that. Oh no. I'll try using this guy. Still did quite a bit of damage. Yeah, we can have Isaac just take him out. Remove him from the turn order, and then it'll be the Iron, who probably won't do that much damage. Yeah, true. And then we'll have Sherry... Kill it! Okay, what is their objective, by the way? Like... Oh! I just right. like we've been just like killing enemies here. I thought there was a marker. Is there not? There is, there is, but okay. it's I just I think it's off screen or something. I've just kind of been like sitting here, watching the battles, chilling. Mm -hmm. Altana is at... Uh, alright. This thing, like, it's not too strong, but it just has a little more HP than the other. Yeah, it's just kind of annoying. Also, it hits pretty hard, too. Like, it always hits for, like, a hundred-something. Yeah. Honestly, my question is, like, thinking about, like, the story of the game, like, remember in the very beginning, um, when Sherry was in her house and she was like, oh, it's that movie, like, in the oh, room future yeah. or whatever. It was just this with Altana. Was it this? Yeah. Oh, So sure. I was like, like, is it, that wasn't a movie, was it? Like, why was that on her TV? Yeah. But then, like, it wasn't only her that knew about that movie, right? Yeah, Other it was her grandma. Like, she went to her, the cafe and her grandma was watching it. Mm -hmm. So, okay, he's not in good shape, but... So I, I want to know, like, what the deal was with that. That's true. Because that was our battle tutorial. It was Altana. Yeah. It was, like, him fighting, like, a random enemy in the future. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I wonder. I don't know. Because everyone, like, just seemed to think it was a normal movie. Holy shit. And that thing is still not dead. Yeah, that's true. That's so much HP. <laughs> nice. Yeah, that'll, like, fully heal you if you get a kill shot with it. New skill. Oh, that must mean... I bet you Peglio has a bunch of new skills as well. Probably, and Toulouse, maybe, yeah. as well. Because we haven't used them in a while. So we got full heal, which is actually really awesome. Oh, sweet. Also status effects. Nice. And then Isaac got... He didn't get anything. Not on this form, maybe one of his other forms. I guess, but it didn't say skill get by him. Oh, no, it didn't? No, it, it was just by Sherry. Oh, okay. Let's see if... Do we have any new... F no, these are... I don't are, think so. Yeah. And then... Nothing new, right? I can't actually can't remember. I've been used... Did he have Symphonia? Before? Oh, you know what? That might be new, actually. Oh, that's cool. That's like a regen skill. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I like that. Just see what's over here. So that means, quick. like, we have three characters that can heal now. Basically, yeah.
throw that on one of our characters. Did that say salamander belt? Did it? I don't know, it said salamander something. We'll take a look. Actually, this wasn't paying that much attention. That probably means it's like a fire affinity thing. Maybe, yeah. I would assume. I don't know why I think fire when I think of salamander, but I mean, I I'm do. Charmander, maybe? Oh, maybe that's why? I don't know, because they like live in the desert, right? Right? I don't know. <laughs> I, I, don't, I really don't know. I don't know where salamander is. Like, I don't know. Yeah. It's not People watching this are like, you guys are so stupid. It's like not. It's not anything that I've ever like thought of in my life. Like, no, where does either. salamander live? I just I know, never I just, thought about it. I imagine like they're living in the desert for some reason. I mean, am I wrong? I, it's, reason, it's reasonable, I think. Like, am I right? I don't know. These things are just like really weak, like we'll one-shot this. Yeah. If this game was like super popular, they can basically make Transformer-like toys for them. Where they go from like regular appliance to like the monsters. Okay, yeah. Iron to floating iron <laughs> eyes, I guess, yeah. <laughs> like what? What would the transformation be? You like pull the cord out a little bit, and <laughs> yeah. then like it has eyes that kind of flip up, and then it somehow floats because it's a really well, yeah, advanced. When you toy. hold it, when you hold it, that's when from it... the cord. No, from just oh, just hold it. Yeah. <laughs> I guess that's how children's toys work. You know, you got to use your imagination. I found what I want. I want this one. Honestly, like, I'm not sure how far we've traveled like since the save point to here. I don't think it's actually been very far. Yeah, I don't think it's very far at all. I think if we wanted to just heal, we could easily just like run back, kind of avoid mm -hmm. uh, a lot of the fights. And then heal up. We won't though, that would be a waste of everyone's time. Yeah. Including ours. Yeah, we're doing fine I think. Mm, we're good. And we got a bunch of those like revive item things. Should we switch one of our party members out, like Altana? I don't know. Like put Petweo back in or something? What's the point of that? I don't know, just... Because they all it. get experience anyway, They do, right? they do. Um, but just to change up. The formation a bit? I don't know. I mean, you could. Altana's I like really all good the characters. Though. Yeah, he's good. Altana right now is good. Especially when we get the iron and dog enemies. I just wish like sometimes that the game would just let you have a huge party so you can just play like with like, Star all the Ocean, characters you want. Like Star Ocean 5. How many could you play with? I actually... Okay, here's the thing. I actually didn't play Star Ocean 5. Oh. But I saw like a video or a screenshot of someone playing it, mm -hmm. and your party is like comically big. Like more than six, I think. More than six? Dang! Yeah. And it's like six an action like... it's an action RPG too, so like everyone is like on the field. Oh god. Yeah. That sounds like a bad idea. At least I think it's more than six. That sounds like a recipe for like frame rate dropping. Oh yeah, I mean <laughs> pro probably. <laughs> yeah. Probably. <laughs> For me, I think, yeah, the game that I've seen with the most party members is like six, I'm pretty sure. In a turn-based or just in general, like any kind of... That was in, yeah, turn-based. Actually, wait, I think the most was nine. Like... It was like a really old Lufia game. And that was, that was turn-based, right? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was nine. I could be wrong. Or maybe you could only use three at a time, but then, I don't know, you had- I remember you had a formation of, like, the nine characters that you made. Ugh, it was a long time ago, I, I can't- I can't remember it. I think, like, a sweet spot. If you're playing a turn-based game, mm -hmm. um, I think four is probably, like, a sweet spot. Nah, I want more. Give me more. Because well, then you're- Don't listen to him. Your player action is just, like, you know what I mean? Like, you're just in- the menu for a really long time, you know what I mean? Like, yeah. like when you play like a game like 
fuck your chronicles for example mm -hmm. like you have like an entire army to just like you do all their commands yeah so instead of i don't know like your phases are just really long because it's like command and and then you just watch it execute Don't you, like, move them and, like, shoot and stuff? Yeah, I guess. Or, like, Fire Emblem, for example. That'll be, like, because you have... Oh, yeah, that's right. That's just, like, imagine everyone is in oh, your party, true. which is... If you're thinking of games like that, yeah, you have a shit ton of, like, party members. Yeah, but that's forgiven, because that's an SRPG. Mm -hmm. But just imagine that is in, like, a regular turn-based RPG, like... I don't know. I'm not opposed to it. I just like being able to use the characters I like. How would you put that on the menu then? Like how? Look on the right side of the screen, right? We have three profile pictures. Yeah. So you just move those to the side and put <laughs> so three like half more. The screen, half the screen. You make them smaller okay. and you put three more. That would be. Oh my god! That would just be so much. And then your res your result screen is just like all numbers. <laughs> just data. <laughs> just like... Or just nothing and you just show all the characters. Okay. We all we did in the last like twenty minutes is Fight shit. Is this, yeah. And like walk two steps. Yeah. I feel like maybe we shouldn't have like gotten all these fights, but whatever. Well, you're the one in control. You're you're on on the steering wheel? I don't know what I'm trying to say. I'm on the steering wheel? Yeah. I'm on the You're steering wheel. You're on it. <laughs> You're sitting on I'm it. I'm on the steering wheel. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead. Let's take a break. <laughs> and when we come back, we'll, I will guess we'll do more of this. Um, we should be really, really close to our objective anyways. I think it's just past this area anyways. Hopefully. Yeah, hopefully. If you don't want to miss that, keep it on the channel. We'll be up with it in a couple of days. Go ahead and let me know what you thought. Leave a comment down below. You can follow me on Twitter. Um... A link will be in the description to my profile. Go ahead and check it out. If you have extra time and you want another video to enjoy, I guess you can check out the channel if you like Japanese games. will probably be something for you there. But as always, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you again. Take care. Bye.